Hey y'all, what's up y'all? It's your girl Bria and your boy D Gill. Shut and it. We are the, the Gill. Mm. Mm. And mm. this is our YouTube. Mm. 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 And mm. y'all know what to do. Mm. Hey. Like hey. and subscribe. Hey. Like, like and subscribe. Hey. Hey. Like and subscribe. Hey. Like, hey. like hey. and subscribe. Hey. That's gonna be our intro. Hey. That's gonna be our intro. Replay. That's gonna be our intro. Hey. That's gonna be our intro. Yes. What up, YouTube friends and family? You better flow, babe. Oh, I know how to do it on the camera. You better flow. Hey, y'all. What up, y'all? It's your girl, Bria. I am one of the half of Big Gills. And today, I'm going to be doing a takedown wash day and get ready with your girl. <laughs> So let's get to it. As you can see, I'm showing you guys my new growth. I have had these braids in since December. I got a touch up back in January and now it's time to take them down. Um, I've been using my products. I'm gonna be showing you guys later on today what I've been um, using to get my new growth on point. This is the longest I've ever had braids in my hair. I usually don't have them this long. Here is my deep cleaning conditioner that I use. Um, I've learned something new from my girl, Eugenia Kelsey, who is cold. Please, please, please follow her on Instagram at Eugenia Kelsey. And you can find her on YouTube, Eugenia Kelsey. When I told you this girl is cold and bad, and I literally followed her from when she had short hair, to now her hair being past her butt, the girl is cold. So I literally buy all of my products from her um, besides the shampoo. She doesn't have shampoo yet. Um, so we'll get to that later. But one thing she taught me was how to deep uh, clean, deep condition my hair before taking out my braids. One thing she taught me was to spend more time on the process of taking it down. Um, with that being deep conditioning the roots, massaging it in really good so it can break down the dirt, the buildup product, and the length that's in your hair. And what that deep conditioning is going to do is going to soften the hair, making it easier to unravel for you. So I would definitely take more time, uh, spend more time with the unraveling process uh, and really deep, deep conditioning my roots. As you see, I'm massaging them in. Get in there good, good. Get in there. Scrub it up, dub. Make sure you guys like this video because there will be more videos like this. So you might as well go ahead and like, like, like. But I'm getting up in there really good. Taking the time to really make sure that I massage and getting them roots good so my like I said the process is easier to take down it also softens the hair which helps it from breaking your hair off when you unravel and it also helps to retain the length of your new growth so deep conditioning is very important to do when you have braids in so you can retain that new length that you have honey so with that being said make sure you guys fully 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 deep condition your hair to strengthen the protein bond that's in your hair um, it will definitely definitely help if you deep condition your hair just so you can have that protein because everyone needs protein not just for food but for the hair too can i just say first of all that my scalp in the beginning of this video was clean my scalp was clean um i love a clean scalp <laughs> it shows up my hair is healthy it's not dry it's just clean I love it. And now my hair is done. Oh, can't tell me nothing. Can't tell me nothing. My hair is, uh, this is my hair with the braids down, sticking out. I'm just playing with it, you know, feeling myself, checking the length. Yes, fire. Go ahead, Bria. Go ahead, Bria. Yes, girl. Yes, yes. <laughs> you thought it was over? Nope, still ain't over. Now I gotta add in my rice water. Um, I make my own rice water thanks to my girl Asia who put me on. The only thing that I always forget is the scent. So it literally smells like dirty water to me. 
it's nasty, it's icky. It be having my whole kitchen and basically the whole house stinking and Dylan hates it. That is why I'm doing it while he is at work because I ain't trying to hear him say it stank. Um, so I don't have any of my essential oils or my scents in this. It's just really rice in the water okay so right now i am making sure that i get in there deep conditioning with that mind you the deep conditioner from um regina is still in there so i am just adding now on um, the rice water to help this also helps strengthen the protein um, bond in your hair um, so right now i'm just trying to make sure that my hair is strong and good to go um Rubbing it in there, massaging it. You know what I say? You always massage that scalp. Massage that scalp like you massage that body. Hair care is everything, just like self care. So, love on your hair. It needs love. I'm learning so much about my hair um, still. Uh, what to do, what not to do. Make sure you guys share. I don't know what y'all waiting for. But go ahead and share this video because like i said there will be more videos like this and we need to have more videos like this um for 4c hair 4c hair is a lot to deal with okay you get that sucker wet it shrivels right on up as you saw as you see wait this ain't this ain't even shrinkage yet and as you see more the more soaked and wet my hair is the shrinkage is starting to happen but i'm going to keep massaging getting that deep conditioner really in there good with the rice water soaking it i'm like obsessed with my rice water i'm not gonna lie to you i literally make enough for about five treatments that I could do. I do not play. Shout out to Asia for putting me on the rice water. Still soaking it. Soak, soak, soak. Get in there. Massage it. I've had these braids in since December, honey. I gotta make sure I'm good. My hair is so healthy, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Look at that scalp. Oh, yes. Just love it. Still getting up in there, deep conditioning, deep conditioning, massaging, massaging, giving my hair love. This is what I mean when I say spend more time on your hair. And now we're about to go and wash it out. All right, now my hair is all clean and good. It's soft. As you see, the shrinkage game is real. Um, but I use my products from Mele, which I love, which is their rice water. It makes my hair really soft. I love them. And then I have my moisturizing leave-in conditioner from Eugene um, Curls. The K is silent. <laughs> and now I'm going to go ahead and put that in. I love showing you guys the texture of the products that I use. And less is definitely more, but I don't know any better. I'm gonna do what I do best and put a lot. 
I'm just gonna go ahead and get on in there, get in there. Yes, honey, ooh, that feels so good. Now I got a really clean, clean, clean scalp. Take off the glasses, you know what to do, Brie, yep. Get on in there. So I'm just going to add my leave-in moisturizer. I love my hair. How it just shrinks up like that. Get on in there and massage it in. Make sure you guys subscribe. I don't know why you guys have not subscribed yet if you haven't. And if you have, thank you for subscribing. And if you're new, we welcome you. Get in that kitchen, get in that back. Massaging the roots. My hair is really thick. And I think that's why I use so much products because I know my hair is thick, so I just prefer just to use a lot. But I can say her products do last me for over at least three months because I still have it. I bought the moisturizer leave-in once and I still have it. So it's definitely worth it. Massaging, getting in there. Enjoying it, giving her love. Okay, and now I'm about to oil my scalp. Oil my scalp and braid. Now, child, I can braid. Not my own hair. <laughs> so my braids are going to be looking a little diagonal crazy, but it is what it is. It's gonna be for a wig. So I'm parting my hair, getting my grease, coconut oil, Making sure that my hair is moisturized, that I'm feeding my hair, giving it all its vitamin A, B, C, and D. I'm gonna go ahead and add my uh, oil, castor oil. And like I said, I don't know any better. I'm just gonna add a lot. And then I'm gonna try calling myself <laughs> to braid a cone road. If you not have done so already, please follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. Make sure you guys check us out on those platforms as well. Shout out to my mom for my first ever steam cap that she got me for Christmas. This is also a unraveling unboxing because I have not used it yet. So I'm checking it all out. The thank you card they gave me and to also tag them in this. And I'm reading it, forgetting that I'm recording just that quick. Here's the cap. It's very nice. Fits my big head perfectly. The controller. And it gets hot really quick. It literally takes about 15 seconds. 
my cap that they gave me to put on. So now that my hair is all oiled up and conditioned up, I'm gonna put on my steam cap and try out this Afro steam cap for the first time with you guys. And now we wait, waiting, just waiting. I'm feeling myself, feeling myself, feeling my. And now uh, here I go, trying to braid. <laughs> this is after my hair has been steamed, so soft. So nice. Me watching my, don't mind my facial expressions. I'm over here watching Housewives. My Housewives. So you might see me talk to the TV, make weird facial expressions. Because I'm like, what the heck is going on? And here I go, trying to attempt something I know I can't do, but I'm going to do. Confused, lost, don't know what I'm doing. Trying to get it together. Figuring, asking myself, how do they do this? How do you keep it like that? How do you connect it and keep it going? But we're doing it. Chell, finally. Something. It's called a Bria corn roll because it, <laughs> it's a corn roll. It's something. Look at me. I don't know what I'm doing. But Chell, I'm doing it. All right. Now, I'm on the other side. Trying to get my life together as I watch my housewife shows. Did you like our video? Go ahead and like, like, like. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Like, 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 like.
now I'm done. Oh, I'm feeling myself like I did something crooked, but it is what it is. It's gonna be covered, so who cares? Now I'm gonna take the loose ends of the braids and braid them all together so they can lay down. But I'm over it. Shout out to the hair braiders and the people that do hair because, child. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. I'm braiding them all up. Trying to get my life together. Trying to be nosy on the TV. Good to go. Child, I really thought I did something. No crooked braids. Got my shade, moisture, snot. <laughs> Lays down everything really good. Look at that. Snotty. Thick. I'm laying down these edges.
All right, got my cap on, got my got to be glue. Go ahead and do that real quick. Pass my hairline. Dabble, 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 dab. If you really care, go ahead and share. Share, share, share. I appreciate the love. And now I've got my blow dryer. And we dry, we dry, we dry, dry, dry. Then I got this stuff from my local store. Put that on and it really worked. Laid it on down. Bam, and there I am. Batty, period. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you subscribe. Bye. Hey, and be hey. on the lookout for them gifts. Hey. For them gifts. Hey. For them gifts. Hey. Be on the lookout for them gifts. Because hey. they coming live to you soon. Check it out. Hey. Coming live to you soon. Check it out. Hey. Coming live to you soon. Check it out. Hey. 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 What you say? What now? you say? Hey. Hey. What you say? Now? Hey.